okay let's continue with this this um this challenge because it's a challenge for me continue with this let's go <sighs> so the last one i'm going to to record this It's already okay. It's already. Wait. There you go. Okay, so let's continue. So the last part, the last um, the last uh, stream we were this part. Wait. This part. The second part. Now let's continue with the rest. Mm. Should I do the front one first? This one? Or maybe this one? Mm. This is the reference here. The ones that, are, that don't know. I think I'm going to work in the one in front. I'm going to continue the. Should I do the stunts? Mm. Let me sit correctly. There you go. <laughs> This is complicated. Okay, so I think uh, let's finish here. Let's finish here. And so we have here in this. Um, finish this part hopefully it won't take too much hopefully hopefully okay so let's let's go let's go okay let's try with these um i like to do like this um small tool of straight lines straight lines tool hmm okay Let's do like the um, type of um, liner here. This round stuff is like mm, it shouldn't be there. Okay, for now. For now, let's, um, let's do this. Something like this. The idea is that it's like a, like a door. Something like that. Something, something. Wait. Oh. There's a problem here. It's not completely like striped. It's a little bit like. Mm 
Mr. Crow. So this is like something here, but I'm, I'm not sure what it's. This thing. Oh, 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 I was doing it in another layer. But yeah. There you are. This should be on top here. Something like this. Let's save. Let's be saving because it will be terrible. <laughs> so yeah, I mean, it's not like I studied uh, perspective. I said before, I'm not like studying. Studying. I, I did like uh, some more course. Um, of basics, you know, basic perspective, but I didn't use too much of those rules in this, in this one. I mean, I really wanted to look good, but it's like, one thing is like, uh, do the course and the other thing is like actually understand <laughs> what is happening. <laughs> so... It's, it's difficult, my perspective is super difficult, I'm really not used to it, really not, it's not my strength, but I'm trying, okay, I'm trying, try so hard, try so hard and get so far. Okay, and here, there's something that is a little bit, um, I don't like about this too much. Do use these lines, these color lines. I added here like gradient, but now that I think about it, I'm not sure how to do it here. Mm. Mm. Something like this, I guess. And here it has to be like something is trying. There's probably some sense about line now. I think it will be more like um like stone like stone. So it won't be like that uh something like this, I guess, it's the obvious. Hmm. Not really sure how this is going to end though. Mm. 
do a little bit of this lines. To the front a little bit of volume so it's not too like flat flat you know I'm not sure about this part of the cut <laughs> I don't think it's going to well, well, well. I can't I can't um, let's not like The words have power, so let's not say it's saving, you know? We have to believe. We have to believe that it's going to be good. We have to believe that it should be nice. We'll see. It should be nice. Let's do this a little bit. Sorry that it's looking strange, but we're going to fix it. Yeah, like, we have to believe we, we can't uh, punish um, a work without our words. A work? Okay, a project with our words. Not to say everything is going to be alright. And at the end. There's more possibilities that go with that. So, <laughs> even with all the insecurities, we're going to make it. Even if you're super insecure about it, just say it. <laughs> At the end, there's more possibilities that it ends up good because you say it. Or you say that it's going to be a terrible mistake. All information it opens up the possibility that. Wrong, you know? So let's be positive. So let's see, that is going to end up nice. And there, ha this, there is no reason that it ends up not being nice. There's no reason. Should look good. I mean, this part is not looking that bad. I mean, it's uh, yeah, we can handle it. We can do it. We can figure it out. So, yeah, yeah. Let's see. So this is the. This 
just now look into yeah, the perspective line of this one is here. This thing should be from here to here. Okay, so if the perspective line here is here, it should be here. This should be here. This should be here. You know? Let's do this one too. Maybe here. Mm, and here. Mm, it should be here. Something like this. So in this part. I'm gonna roll this at the That's not good, so let's try to fix it. We can fix something like this with a, with a little bit of like stone style. Let me run this in the corner. Something like this. No, not too much. Something like this. There we go. That gives a little bit of um a little bit of texture to the ink. To the two stuff again. This is a stone. I'm going to add it. And it looks like it's growing from stone. Or the stone. Yeah, it's growing from stone. From stone. This idea. I think this part is going to be a little bit um simpler than I thought. But now let's do that like this type of stone stuff. Maybe I can finish this part quickly and continue with this. Let's do it this. Mm. Let's do what I want. Mm. 
and like um wood wood and to here I will make it a little bit like open Maybe some sort of decoration here in this part. I do normally they have like this stone arc of a <gasps> didn't say something. This is so bad. Just not I said. I don't know if you can, but look, this starts here in the door, and this one is. Ugh. <laughs> this is so bad. So what I'm going to do is again with this. I'm not sure if this was good. Let's to start maybe here. What a problem! What a problem we have here. Something like this, I guess. Then I'll do. This is complicated. Eh? 
sounds in it. No, imagine that it all those lines. <laughs> and I'm doing it in the This is crazy. Okay, let's continue. It's okay, we're learning. We're learning. We're learning. Um, I mean, I don't dislike these things. Let me check again. I don't like. I don't dislike this, this strange perspective we have here. To be honest, I will change maybe from here to here. Be a little bit changing. It's a mess, but we are on it. We're trying. I think it's you know, but it's not bad that it stays a little bit um like sketchy lines and stuff because it's like it makes it a little bit like the texture, you know. I know, like, for example, a little bit neglected stuff here, you know? Neglected stone stuff. Cracks and stuff. I think this one is not here. Should be here. This one from here. Mm. This one as well. I try to not be in like corners so um, it's gray. So I will add a little bit of up something. <laughs> A little bit of something. Then it kind of start looking better. this one to look more woody mm. I 
Hello. Hello, Fai. Welcome, welcome to my art stream. We're trying to do a castle. Thank you so much for being here. Welcome. <laughs> I'm trying to do like this entrance. I'm using a little bit of basic perspective, like this line here. What whip tree? <laughs> well, whip tree is like it's supposed to be like the the um, evolution of web through the uh, web two that is up social media and stuff. A uh, web tree would be more like decentralized. That's the idea, no? Like, doesn't have like a like an actual company that leads it, but like the idea is that everyone is part of it, you know? I think it's like like a random lesson, a uh, random brief synopsis. I'm sorry. <laughs> so yeah, the idea is that. Everyone can. Like Bitcoin. <laughs> well, the Bitcoin is part of it, but Web3 is bigger than that. The Web3 is supposed to hold all the blockchains, and Bitcoin is only one. From there's a lot, there's Ethereum, there's a Cardano, I think, Solana. There's a lot, and the idea is that no bank is the leader, you know, just like you and your connection with your with the blockchain. So that's why people is like, ah, oh, it's a revolution. It's a revolution. Because it is. It's like the next step, I think. It's just that it's super new and of course it has its own issues, you know? But yeah. Hey! What happened here? Hey, thank you so much for the follow, Solarga. <laughs> thank you so much. Welcome, welcome to my stream. I'm an artist streaming art. <laughs> the process of this uh, castle making. Do you prefer guitar music or hip hop? Ooh. That's a tough question. Because I like both. Like. Sometimes, um, sometimes I'm more into like uh, some guitar riffs or something. I'm sorry, my accent and my English. I'm not a native English speaker. Sometimes I like, for example, listening to uh, rock bands and stuff. But sometimes I'm, I feel like hearing pop music, hip hop stuff. But if I will, like, if they tell me, okay, um, just hear this for the rest of my life, I think I'll prefer guitar, the guitar. I don't know, it's kind of relaxing. I mean, yeah. Well, sometimes it's relaxing. I think the guitar is like, it can be relaxing and it can be like powerful at the same time. So, I think it has a lot of, um, it can be adaptative and it has a lot of moods, so I, will, I think I would choose that one, but I like all type of music, to be honest. And you? Which one do you prefer? I, yeah, I, sometimes, yeah, some guitar things are nice. I like rock bands. I like Disturbed. I 
like some classic ones. Like Led Zeppelin. Like Funk style. But I also like pop. <laughs> and hip hop. I think between hip hop and pop, I think um, I'll say. Pop music because I don't know pop music like has a lot of some awesome it like it opens the creativity it digging for example you can make rock, hip hop, or something in a song that is pop. It's strange. <laughs> so yeah. I think this needs something here. It's like an arc. This is the reference. This arc here. I don't know if it's, it's a little bit super pixelated, but here there's an arc around, I don't know if you can see it, so I think I will do that. I think I will do that, I'll do that here. It goes here first. Hmm. Wait. Something like this. I wouldn't say that it's perfect, but I'm going to make uh, fix it with some um, texture stuff, like doing that thing is here. The thing is, <laughs> the how's that called? Bricks. Well, they're like stone bricks or something like that. I mean, it's not bad, it can be better, let's see how, go, how can we fix it, maybe, okay, I have an idea, wait a second, I'm going to do this, something like this, and I'm going to like, and curve a little bit the corners, but give me a second. This moment looks terrible. <laughs> well, so what I'm going to do is like trying to curve a little bit the borders here. Let me let me like do something like this, like delete a little bit these corners. Oh no, it looks bad, but it's going to be worth it. I never expand 
so long in the background. I'm more used to draw people, like characters and stuff. But it's true that sometimes uh, knowing how to do backgrounds is super important if you want to do like. Oh, it wasn't deleted. <sighs> I wasn't deleted and I was drawing on top. Then another. Let's select this a little bit. Hmm. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. Short no. Oh, yes? No. So, yeah. Um, Oh wait, I want just to do this, and that's it. Yeah, I'm not like... I'm more used to draw um, people and characters. Because I'm like, okay, I want to like... I have a lot of ideas in my mind of lore... Histories... Stories, I'm sorry, my, my accent in my English. Some stories... More than like actual environments, atmospheres. I should enjoy more like drawing uh, drawing backgrounds because it's relaxing sometimes. But my mom likes more drawing like natural panoramics and stuff but I'm more like people I like more people because I like people I like to draw people their own stories of people mm. yeah something like this I think it looks better the good thing is like with stones you can create like it shouldn't be like if you see it's not like exactly the same one to each one so it will makes it look a little bit more natural like a yeah natural feeling so it's not bad at all. The idea of this uh, shot, this, um, this castle, is just a panel of, of uh, well, it's going to be an NFT as well, a river NFT for our holders, and also it's going to be a webtoon panel for the, for the story that our holders are supporting. Because to be honest, um, I don't like to like um, tell people in my um, that supports my art like, hey, you're going to if you buy my art, you're going to become rich because I'm I'm planning to do this and this and this and this and then no, it's like I see it like they're supporting this project like they're not like. It's like, I take it as a support, more than an and and I tell them, I tell them, hey, it's like, this is, because it's true, it's like, you can't like, you can't like promise stuff that you're not sure that it's going to happen. And all NFTs, NFT projects are, I'm sorry, uh, NFT projects, are well as redundant as it sounds their projects and projects are not sure that if they're going to become true you know but i'm here all the day for well, all the weeks working and working on it because it's a dream you know but yeah i told them what you're wor what you're su what you're doing by my NFTs is supporting me. I can't promise that I that you're going to become rich. 
because look <laughs> there's only three people watching me you know it will be a lie but I have plans I have plans to to make this everything worth it But it's like Patreon. I don't. I don't know. It's like I say it like like Patreon. If you support me, I'll give you stuffy. <laughs> you know, monthly stuffy. That's what I'm doing with my holders of monomoids. It's like you support me, I'll give you monthly stuff. And you're going to be the first to know the development of this project. I know that it sounds like maybe like oh no if she doesn't know like she if he you know like maybe investors won't invest if I say those things but it's like you as a creative for a project you can just go there and promise things that you're not sure that you cannot fulfill like in every project there's risks you know I'm just going to do all all my heart give all my heart all my willing to do this because i love what i'm doing and until i die i'm going to work on my projects and I don't, and see how far they reach but yeah Because, I mean, I like to dream big, you know, but my projects are more like long time. There's a lot of people that likes that to like invest uh, one day and then next week, oh my god, my 100 in this <laughs> the investment become, became 1000 in one week not going to happen <laughs> I mean maybe there's projects like that but most of it they're not I mean it's like hitting lottery if you <laughs> you know you have to be super lucky I wish I think this that is like one of the most difficult challenges is to add value of your art when when you have an NFT project. It's like you launch it, and now what? It's like you need to improve your value on it. That's the big biggest challenge for a create for a creator for a for an NFT project owner. It's like okay, people have invested in you. You need to give them value and keep doing and keep working on it what are you going to do? Mm. should I do an event? should I do a uh, pay a big um, advertising? because they become like like if your tokens became like some small stocks of your business I don't know if that's what it said So if they become like they're holding stocks from your small project because it's a project that is not even a business then. And you have to be so devoted to it if you want to see it work, you know? The thing is that I really like to create content. So I can, I don't know, like create stuff about it. I decided to leave my my full-time job. 
and just like draw draw on how that I can continue drawing and creating content for from all my projects and one of my one of my dreams that I want to do is pay a billboard on Times Square It's one of my dreams. <laughs> I can't wait. Like, ah, oh, look. You just said, Tali Pukta Boys, and I'm gonna move chat. In the billboard. I have to create a good advertisement so people get interested. I can't wait. This is one of my goals. I, I think I will cry that day. I mean, yes. I'm going to cry <laughs> a lot when that happens. I want to be good and creative. Hmm. I don't. I'm. I. I'm not sure what I'm going to put there, but it has to be so catchy so people. I don't know. This is one of my challenges and one of my dreams. I really want to make the studio I want to create with, with these projects be able to like create content around the words be amazing and then amazing thing is that the holders that of those NFTs were the first one that made it happen, you know? It'll be so spoiled. <laughs> I'll be so happy. And that day, I'm planning it. The day has to come. One day though, it's going to happen. And also I want to create a physical store. Like art craft store and um, related with dogs. Like, I don't know, like a daycare. It would be amazing. It's like dreams. Like my whole life dreams. To be honest, I can wait. But for that, you can you can have all the all the um, I don't know how to explain it. Like all the willing. No, that's not the word. Like all the one. Like you really want to do it, but. You need to mix actions with within. So you have to work. You have to work with work. Sometimes I'm like, I'm so tired. I want to take this week off. But I'm like For example today I was like, I don't want to open the stream. I feel tired. Uh but then I have to delete this but then it's like you remember that if you don't do it if you don't work for your dreams it's like the most you postpone them the more difficult to achieve it becomes you know So I'd rather not postpone them too much. Mm, I don't know what I did here. Let's see if I can fix it. So yeah, the most you postpone working for your dreams, the more far away to reach it becomes. 
so rather like that's why I open these uh, streams really up motivate me to work on my projects because words are beautiful you know but if your words doesn't like doesn't come with actions they're not worth it they like they mean nothing so yeah I don't like this line here. This is a little bit messy, but I think we're going to fix it uh, with the. Um, Shadows and stuff on the highlights. Let's see if we can do that. So, yeah. Mm. There's something here that is missing. But for now, I'm going to work on this. Mm. I'm going to uh, select this part. Get a little bit darker. Mm. Yahoo. Something like this, maybe. Same with that. I'm going to do the same with this. This small doggy here. Keep up. We're happy. We're happy. He's like going close, letting me know that he's here, and then ha! Agarra! Look at him. We're happy. Happy and dog time. Dog time. He's called Romeo. Romeo, say hi to the audience, to the big audience, to the thousands that are looking at us. <laughs> Hello, thousands of people. No, he's a kitty. <laughs> mm, I haven't brushed him today. This type of beard needs to be brushed every day. Oh! Oof! I just got my. Ah, my leg numb. Oof! Okay, let's go. Wow! The kitty! What happened? What happened? What happened? No! Can you see that I'm busy? I'm busy. Hmm. What happened? What happened? <laughs> Can you see I'm busy? I'm busy working. And people is watching. What should we do? What should we do? Okay. 
I'm going to leave him here if he wants to be here. And I'm going to keep drawing. I uh, want to do... You want to leave? Okay. I'm going to select these stones. Um, this bridge and that being a little bit longer than I expected. Imagine the rest of the castle. Jesus Christ, this is taking a lot. And there's a lot of things that I want to, that I, I have to do. That is, um, that is a foundation reward for one of the monomeric colors that wanna, that wanna, Give away. I'm going to give them a foundation in the last two. And I want to do those type of um those type of giveaways monthly, but the problem is that I got super delayed because I had to work as freelancer, you know, to uh, this company. But when I see that it's, it was taking me too much time, like, I really, for my project, I literally got sick, like, like, sick that I have airbags. They were worse. I, I, airbags. <laughs> Eye bags. Eye bags. They got worse that those days, like, but depressive it was so sad almost crying every night you know i get literally physically sick like and sometimes i got these stress attacks i don't know how it is but it's not like it's not like a panic attack because what my mom told me to, uh, yeah my, what my mom told me about panic attacks is that you feel panic you know, oh. in the Bradenton way of things, like you feel like this fear. I got this strange, I don't know how they are to be honest, but it's like my body feel like I got, I get so stressed that my body, like my chest starts to be heavy, I can't breathe properly, and I'm like. I'm like, uh, uh, this is how people die. <laughs> type of that situation in that in that attack. Like, I, I, is this how people die? I don't want to die like this, but I'm trying to to breathe, and it it like it fades away with a massage. It's like I remember the first time that I was that I got it, and I was super worried because I thought I was I was sick. And then my mom gave me this massage with Big Papa Root, this cream, a uh, mental cream, Big, Big Papa Root, something like that. Papa um, Root, and she she made me a massage, and like nothing. It's like she made me a massage, even pray for me, and then. It was, it was healed. <laughs> so, and then she says, that's a stress. And I was like, what? <laughs> well, because I literally was thinking that I was going to die. Like, but I was, it wasn't like a panically die. It was like, because like panic and now I felt like, oh, maybe I should do, go to the... <laughs> hospital type of stuff, you know? Because I can't breathe properly and if I was going to get COVID or something, I don't know. She said it was a stress and I was like, okay. Well, those things happen when I was 
when I was uh, working for this company and mentally was I don't know I hate when things that are mental become became physical it's like well I don't know so I decided to leave my job and yeah and I'm now of course it's uh, it's been more difficult for the income and stuff but nothing makes me hap more happy than work on my on my projects and mm, more when there's people that are really invest on them you know they really support me to like make the project reality so I have to focus on this it's like I feel that I owe it I owe it to them you know so yeah that was my story about, uh, about my job oh what happened here Next. I don't know about this. Mm, what if I go multiply here? doesn't look bad at all but do I like it? If I'm going to do this, I need to fix these lines. Let me check. I promise that I delete the. Okay. I really delete the. They look um. They look a little bit like brighter i don't know why the like the um, the coloring and stuff looks a little bit bright hmm. something here This bridge looks super looks super simple but look there's almost one hour and a half doing it. Like no <laughs> Like this can be, you know? Type of stuff. What did you want? What? <laughs> what did you want? He's here. 
He wants attention. No. He he was eating my pencil the last time and I was like ah. <laughs> I was like ah, what are you doing? Why are you eating my pencil? <laughs> I was like that. I was crying at all. <laughs> Like that. Mm -hmm. Exactly like that. But thanks God he didn't um, buy the point. He buy this part. And it didn't reach like anything. Just like just here. So. When I try the pencil again, the, it worked. The, the stylus, the stylus again, he worked completely good. So okay. I remember when I got Dali though. <laughs> when Dali was a puppy, he he destroyed me a pencil of these ones, a stylus for my tablet. And I was like, no! And I had to buy another tablet, another stylus. I mean, there in Colombia, um, another stylus will be super expensive. Almost same, like, like there are, like I don't know, like the whole tablet. So. I had to buy another tablet because it, will, it was more like okay, you know, like if it costed like twenty dollars, for example, the stylus, uh, the tablet would cost in the moment twenty one. You know, it was like my okay, let's just one dollar try new stuff. You know. First, and this one is the second. I need to go like this, so I will work a little better. Okay. A little bit like different from there. You know, like I like to add a little bit of texture with ink. I like, I like to do um, line art, it's, line art is one of my favorite things to do. Okay, this is this one. And then here I want to do this. So now that I'm... I'm going to do this and there's some mistakes. I need to take advantage of those mistakes, you know? Type of pop rust that he says why not to say something about my mistakes, you know? The happier accidentally happy stuff. <laughs> so I'm going to take advantage of this and create like a natural style stone. Like this is almost a little bit moved, you know? Every stone doesn't have to be like exactly the same, you know? Normally they have like this uh, big... Like... Concrete division between stones. I'm not sure if I want to go like this. Hmm. Maybe I'm not going to do that. Oh. I'm just not going to do it like this. I'm just like... Mm 
I don't know. Like maybe circles. Double small um, I don't know. Something in it. And only the squares in the top. You know? Something in that. Oof. Okay. The problem about doing backgrounds is that really put my brain put my brain my brain in this hard situation, you know? Because like it tears my brain too much. And more if I'm talking in English because my native <laughs> it's not my native language. So it's a mix. So what is happening here is a mix of brain stuff. <laughs> So I end up, end up super tired, like if I drew 6 hours, you know, like in 2 hours, like if I drew 6 hours, I feel like, <laughs> what is happening? Something like this. Like a dent here. Stuff I guess, you know? Here. I never put so much detail in stones. It's like your stones. But well, I guess I really want this to look good. Somebody says to my what I learned. Was I sure? Here we can do this weird angle because it's already like this is sound is already like uh, like move a little bit uh, out of place so we can do like this move like it's a little bit out of place again <laughs> my brain. You know, Give me a second. Let's just say it. I'm going to put this here. Bring me a, a small second. Go back. So this is this part. Going to do this.
Wow. This is super difficult. Like, well, it's. Yes. <laughs> I was going to say not that difficult, but no, yes, it is. <laughs> it's like, it's like. Like, it takes too mu so much time. I didn't expect this would take that long. To be honest. I will expect them. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I thought I could do um like normally I do a uh, character face in two hours. Wait. Rendering in two hours, but this has taken me at this moment like three hours and a half. To now. Well, without taking into account the sketch, you know, after a sketch like line arts. Ooh, 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 wait, wait, wait. What do we have here? Here is there's some problem here. This is this is here. This has to be here. You know, it's a little bit. Hmm. You know, so this one is good. This one is nice. So let's do it. I would like to add maybe two um two candles to like lights here maybe on the sides I'm not sure if I would like this like this is more cabin I don't think it will look good I think what looks here is looking nice I don't think I will want let's start here then this effect off Of, um, of a brick that shouldn't be laid, you know, like a little bit quick. <laughs> okay. <sighs> God. This is going to be a pain. No. Okay. Erasing this. Let's erase this. But leave that lines below. It kind of looks better like this one. Huh? Maybe not with these lines. Maybe with a uh, and it's like a little bit um, smaller, like slimmer, slimmer line on this maybe. A little bit like. No. 
something like this. Just have a little bit like this. Something like this. What I was saying about being a medieval castle is like you can have some mistakes. So I'll keep it up to you now. Like, I guess. <laughs> I guess it can, I don't know. This part is the part. This one is too square too. I'm thinking it's something terrible, but I'm going to do it. <laughs> something that I shouldn't, but I think I'm going to do it. I prefer guitar music, that's good. Yeah, I think guitar music is um, it's more adaptive. Like, there's some calm ones. You can do a romantic one. But also you can do powerful ones, like for example rap. Maybe some. Uh, so I'm sorry that I didn't see your message. I was a little bit like thinking if I should do this, <laughs> but I think I have to. And this is like something similar what I did. Do you like any bands? Yeah, I like. Um, lately, I'm liking. Too much disturbed. Uh, forgot the name, but it's something like mm, the sickness. <laughs> Get it all with the sickness, something like that. Dun, 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 <laughs> it's really good. What else? Well. I'm hearing a lot, like, The Offspring were one of my favorites. Some 41 were one of my favorites too. The Sound of Silence is really good. He has a really amazing voice, like, even if he's like, blah, 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 you know? But when the Sound of Silence, you can hear his voice actually, and it's so deep and smooth. Even he has his raspy stuff but with that song it's like wow all his talent like they're famous because of something you know and most of the time it's because of talent Bark. Bark, bark. Yeah, 
Uh, I had a lot of ones of him um, in my mind. Like um, I forgot how I forgot how it goes, but it's about this uh, this guy that is going to clean all humanity. It was kind of interesting. I like the animation. I forgot how it goes. Oh, I no. I had I had this um. This song has ringtone when I was younger, that it was like, shout, shout, get it all out. These are the things I can do. Come on, stop it, stop it, talking to you, so come on. Hello. Stop it. Are you going to stop barking? You feeling better? Thank you. <laughs> what else? Um, I like some for one. I like Linkin Park. I like System of a Down. I like from System of a Down, I like a lot. Shot is by tears for fears. Well, I think I think um they did a, a cover of that song. Let me. See, and it was um, show 2000 something. Let's go show 2000. See, show 2000 deserves. I'm just going to put a little bit, not too much because the copyright, but it sounds like this one. I had exactly that ringtone. No more. <laughs> No, because they mute my my <laughs> my my stream. It's show two thousand. Yeah, the one that you said is the first. I think the first band that created. I think because it's like, for example, the Sound of Silence is also a cover. Well, I think everyone. It's like us. The Sound of Silence is a classic. I think, and it's yes the cover of a classic. Song. But I'm not sure to be honest, I'm not sure. But yeah, I'm thinking it's a cool girl. There's another one? But I, I don't know, I like the covers. Sometimes covers are super good, like how they create it, you know? Like they do their version and it's wolf, you know? Oh, what is playlist? This is, um, it's Talija Sessions by League of Legends. I can show you the link if you want to take a look see. it's for content creators and they don't strike they don't strike for copyright so. Yeah, it was a little bit, for example, yesterday I tried to play, um, well, I didn't play, it was uh, my friend Davy. he played um, a little bit of, oh, wait a second, I don't, know. I don't like how this is going, this arc here is making me, 
it's crazy. So it was um we were play uh, he was playing uh, Tales of Arise. Sounds high caffeine caffeine. <laughs> Um, we were playing, he was playing Tales of Arise and only with the intro they mute my my recording I was like what? It's a video game but yeah it um sometimes I just say no because it's copyright I don't like when they mute it because it's like they don't even mute the music also they mute what you're saying so if you're explaining something or talking about something uh, yeah it's not there anymore itch, 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 over here. Uh, my eyes so yeah oh wait I don't like that I'm not finishing this okay I think I'm going to I start doing um start doing the the coloring and the rendering because it's taking too much time this fine art. <laughs> this music is too hyper for me. <laughs> some are too hyper, yes, yeah. some are more relaxed. But yeah. Okay, I'm going to just Go directly to the um, rendering. Ugh, my lips are super dry. So I'm just going to do a super fast. Um, trying to do super fast. Um, um, shadows here in the in the thingy here. I don't know why I did it there. Oh, I think I did it there. I'm going just to... Um, I'm using this tool that it's called Lasso for like... Select what I think is going to be the... The shadows. You know, like... I want to say that one. Let's have the shadows here. Let's have the shadows here. And there. Let's have uh, shadows here a little bit, and maybe here. I'm just going to pass a little bit of this onto the maybe like this. I feel like it's not gorgeous. Oh no, it's so much. Why is doing this? to the phone I don't know so yeah I'm going to continue doing some shadows here I'm going to do it just like quickly like sketchy shadows and then I'm going to see how can we fix it first a little bit sketchy style shadows. <gasps> Wait. Again. Mm. What is happening? There. Mm. Mm. <laughs> Yeah. 
what are the lands? I like this is some phenomenal. Um, I like to add the shadows like a little bit in the gradients so it will feel more um it will feel a little bit more uh, real and more natural. You know, a little bit. So I like to use the airbrush for that. And to do something like this. Let me see if I can. No. Something like this, you know? Mm. Let's just also a little bit of brush stuff. But I don't know, I didn't like to match this. Mm. Let's do normal to see what is happening here. Let's do this one maybe darker. To see if we can do Mm, let me see. Mm. Mm, wow, it's not that bad. Maybe here instead of multiplying. No, it's a bit ah, in my eyes. So multiply this to normal. And let's do darken on this. It's like I think maybe something like this because I don't know. It's like I like how it looked, but at the same time, I was like, mm. I don't know, you know, it's like, uh, no, 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 no. so yeah, I wasn't sure. Kind of like a more than normal effect. You can do a little bit like this to do some stuff. And let's go again to the normal with this one. Let's do some quick um, like radiance here and there. Okay, I'm going to work on this uh, on this. Basic. 
I'm busy, I fly, I'm sorry, baby. You have time to be a joke in English. No, Toby, Toby, Toby. Calm, miss. Calm down. Calm down. Can you calm? Can you calm? Please, can you calm down? I appreciate it. Thank you. <laughs> okay, go. Go on, babe. Something like this, I'll say. I'm just pass by this brush like this, super quick. I'm going to add um, fix this part. I really thought I was going to be able to work on another part of the of the castle today, but it seems I only could do this part. I really want to try um, other parts, you know, like this one behind that I think is one of the most difficult. But this took me a lot. I didn't expect it. because I'm happy about today's stream but a little bit sad because I wish I could like be more productive you know I'm like oh, I should be more productive you know I wish I could. could be more productive, so everything would be better. Like things can be finished faster, you know. But um, but I really want I wanted to like do this right, you know. Like. I really want to like spend time on it. I think I'm going to add um, the video process of this uh, castle to the holders. It would be nice that I know. <gasps> they know how it took, you know? But yeah, it took a lot. <laughs> Look, it took a lot. <laughs> it's here. Everything is here. And it took a lot. Something on this. I really want to add the two light like, lamps. Oh no. Please don't crash, I want to say. 
attention it's because he has I hasn't I haven't groomed him today and he's like <gasps> where's my grooming where's my grooming he likes it he relaxes really he relaxes a lot where's my grooming you promised you promised I will have grooming where's my grooming yeah that's what is happening <laughs> it's uh a little bit of I think what I'm going to do is like add a little bit of here and let's just go with them um, with the likes I want to add here I don't want to like <laughs> I can't believe it I can't believe that this thing took us two hours just can't believe this I'm going to add the lamps because I will feel terrible <laughs> I'm going to create them here in this space lamp so I'm going to do a small symmetric tool I'm a little bit sad. I'm sorry. It's not much older. I'm a little bit sad because I can't believe it. Like it took us. <laughs> it took us two hours. I'm so sad. Well, let's see. Maybe we did. We will fix a little bit with the lamps. Sometimes when it's like. The drum is to like not to jam at it. Maybe something um, contrasting will help you. So let's see if we can do it. So let's do this type of lamps here. Maybe like this. Something like this. But these are going to be the ones that I like in, like in um, the. Like attached in the. Attached in the um, in the wall. So no. Stop it. So I don't want to do something like this maybe like this and if I'm going to do it I want to do it first in front and it's supposed to be like normally they are like in oil it was like a flame that was in oil and this is like the part that is attached so something like this I'm just going to do some Mr. Tan. Something like this, a little bit like stronger liners. I'm going to do it with the same following, but the difference would be the, the flame. They, they will have the same colors. A little bit sketchy, but I really want to finish today's stream with some cotons and we will improve the next stream. The idea is that 
looks nice, you know? So you're like, mm -hmm. And then he has to promote also the, the streams. I'm gonna promote the stream with, uh, only with this. I can't. <laughs> it's difficult. I just can't. So I'm gonna just do this. I love them. I love the symmetric ruler. We just did this in what? Two minutes? I'm just going to focus on this because <laughs> it's not going to help. <laughs> so I'm just going to continue doing this. That's it. I'm going to hide the ruler. Stop it! Can you stop, please? I'm in the middle of a stream. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, baby. She's my baby. I love that. Maybe you you have another time so yeah. I love to have them even if they're like super soundy. <laughs> Okay, something like this. Um, let's select the same type of color for the flame. Something like this. No, no. A ver, a ver, ya. No más. Stop it. The problem with Romeo is that he loves to fight. And he normally fights with the other dogs. And I don't like that. <laughs> it's like small but mighty type of stuff. I don't like that he fights them. The good thing is that the other dogs are super gentle and patient with him. But yeah, I don't like that he looks for for fight. Like he seeks for it. You know? Okay, so I'm going to... A ver! Ojo! 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 Allá no! And they fight precisely in the cables, in the wires. No! No! Yeah, I hate when he fights. That's the only thing I don't like. It's like, everyone is so patient and he's like, mm, I want to fight! I want to fight you because I'm stronger. Oh no, because um, because I um, you're having more fun than me. That's how he, that's the why he fights. You're having more fun than me, then I'm going to fight you. <gasps> oh look! Oh, uh, uh, it's not looking bad. Okay, next one. Okay. I think this one should be it. I don't know, like a bit smaller. Mm, no, I think the same size is good. No. Okay, good. I 
Okay, so what I'm going to do now here is play with these lamps with these lamps uh, bright so so for making it a little bit like monsters and stuff let's add some light here but I'm not sure if that one works mm, that's the normal one yeah. that's the first one in this maybe something this okay. and then maybe some dodos maybe so I don't want it to look like to airbrush stuff so I'm going to try to blend a little bit with this This brush that I like in, like Gosh Blender, and I want to add like in this type of affair also on it. It's like it adds a little bit of like something, you know, something in it that is kind of like I'm not sure it glow touch. Let's see how it looks with I mean it doesn't look bad but it makes some fixes that's it I really like this gosh blender though I also like this texture that is good. I like to work here like this. So the ghost under here a little bit and I some highlights. Something like this, I don't know. I don't like it's like I'm not sure if this one freaks but I'm gonna just do it do it too and then we will see if we can fix it later in the then in the next stream. Let's have like a little bit of uh, Hey! Something? I hear something! Hey! Thank you so much for the follow! Woo! <laughs> it just makes me super happy and that people like to talk with me a little bit <laughs> meanwhile I draw this you know 
It makes me feel good. I'm not even there. Thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate it a lot. <laughs> Have you ever seen a ghost? No, but when I was kid, I remember my mom once told me that when I was a kid, that, that, that typical that the kids tell their parents like they want to sleep with them because they feel fear. I don't remember, but she told me that I saw, that I told her that I saw um, like shadows, like human figures in the in the set in the in the roof in the roof like sail sailing. I don't know sure how it's in English, and that's why I was I wanted to not be alone in that room. I don't remember, but I remember that my mom told me that 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 apartment like there's something like this strong um, spiritual charge in that place because it's like everyone that entered that apartment got like scared you know like tricked by f by spirits so i remember the um, the um, the person that does like uh, the cleaning, I forgot. Uh, sometimes my my English is a little bit, <laughs> a little bit. Um, the house housekeeper, the housekeeper, uh, she went to like grab um, a bucket, and before she touched it, the bucket moved. Then moved to the side, and she was like. running away and telling my mom to what just happened yeah kids can see ghosts but yeah I, I don't remember because uh, maybe my brain for my mental health doesn't want to remember what happened that night but I remember my mom telling me that I was telling that there was a lot of shadows looking at me in the roof I don't know I don't know I to be honest I don't want to remember but I, that's what I told her that's why I don't want it to sleep in the room that night imagine that place was super heavy and my mom got issues too when she worked um, in our city's mayorship there was like a lot of um, phantom stuff you know like ghost stuff and she was like she was like in this room and someone knocked at her door and she was like yeah yeah I'm coming because she thought it was the it was the um, the security because they, they were going to close the, the offices and she was like in the third floor and she w she always ends up like like doing her job or like too late and uh, she thought it was the security and they t told her something like like sh they said like hey something and she doesn't remember because she talked in top of them like oh yeah, yeah, yeah I'm coming I'm coming I'm coming, I'm leaving. And when she opened the door, there were there were not no one. And the security guard, like she went down the third floor. And when she went down, he was like, No, I can't move from here. <laughs> like there's no one and I can't move from my position here in the main door. We were I, I was waiting for you to close the place. But I can move. And that's not the only thing that happened in that in that place. She actually saw like a shadow. 
moving from one place to another, but she quit. <laughs> Are ghosts ghost real? Well, I think there's something like I don't think they came here to uh, to make people scared at them, you know, like like in the movies and stuff but I think there's something between the spiritual world to this world and maybe sometimes people can see it you know maybe when it's too dense or it's too too many I, I, I will say I normally call it like like a spiritual charge you know like a spiritual dance atmosphere stuff like, I don't know if you have seen uh, anime, but I will explain it like this anime explains it that it's called Bleach. Like, sometimes when an, an enemy or someone was too powerful, you can feel this dense atmosphere that the main character like felt like they have to kneel, you know, like... Uh. It was so tense that it felt like they're going to be slammed in the in the floor or something like that. So people actually can feel in their guts that a uh, that a place is dangerous, or you know. But sometimes people like know it, or maybe there's a place that has strong spiritual charges, like spiritual. Wait, I will say wait instead of charge because charge is like I'm going to charge my phone. I will say in English it's spiritual wait. So yeah, I feel like I feel like they exist because the spirits exist for in my beliefs. But I don't think they're they are here like doing damage to other people, you know? Like actually I'm going to kill you or something like that. I don't think they can do that. Like I don't think they're allowed to do that. I think the people if we're going to do to go to that way, I think the only ones that can damage a human but not like that. It's more like in the decisions they made and stuff you the I think they're, I think they're demons. The demons can damage. Uh, even so, I think they have to ask permission. I don't think it's like. Can you put a chill playlist? Let me see. Well, I'm almost done, but there's a ch one that is chiller than this one. And this one. This one is a little bit chill. Chiller. Chiller, a little bit chiller. This one. It's more like natural related. There you go. But I think I'm almost done for today. To be honest, I wanted to do better. But I think the big one will be next the big uh, the big difference will be next stream because I'm going to work on this one so on this big part so the difference will be like hopefully astonished astonished um I wish I could uh oh, what happened let me see It's too chill that it disappear. There you go. There you go. Mm, yeah, so.
forgot that sometimes when you don't like your art or like the art that you sell like you think something needs like you need something else it's better to like try to put it in like a bigger like zoom out sometimes because sometimes it really works for um for the brain to see maybe what type of mistakes or what is lack so I did it and I think something like this I need something like this ah oh, uh. lo-fi chill on let's have maybe some color branching let me see something extra Blur, it's not bad. It's not bad for the heart. Makes it a little bit like. <gasps> what happened? <laughs> what happened? What is happening? What happened? What is happening? Timeline, what is this? I'm so scared right there you go. <laughs> is this photoshop? no it's uh, clip studio paint it's a sad part that it's called clip studio paint <laughs> i got like super scary in a second there I was like, mm, is this <laughs> is this <laughs> super scary all my work <laughs> disappears Yeah, this is a software, and it's Japanese, that it's called Clip Studio Paint. I will think it's a really good uh, competition for to Photoshop. Them. This is more focused on, on drawings, but you can use it like Photoshop too. It's really good. I would recommend it 100%. a moment like it disappear <laughs> it is is it cheaper than photoshop i will say yes because you, you there's an option that you only paid f pay for it once like it's a little bit like a little bit expensive the one the first payment but then you have it for your life so you don't have to pay a monthly stuff but i think in the app if you wanted to have it in an app, in a tablet or cell phone, you have to pay a monthly thingy. But in computer, in PC, in person, uh, you don't have to. You, there's, that's what, this is the one I bought. I bought one license and I have it forever. Mm -hmm. And it has a lot of sound. It even has an option to import 3D art. Um, you draw on top on it, of it. It's really good super recommended and it has like things for manga because it's this uh, this uh software is for mangakas so mangakas that like uh, to draw in digital so they have things like um like um i don't know where they are like here in this effects it has a lot of effects that you can download for manga stuff 
uh, for, also for webtoons. Look, they have also a very pres preset backgrounds if you want. Like, and you can use them for free. I mean, it's included. It's like, I mean, free the license, you know? And you can use it in your, in your, um, your projects. It's really good. It has its own like um, like Photoshop Photoshop elements I think I don't know Photoshop has their their own like presets and assets and stuff and brushes. They have also like a b library full of uh, their own stuff. I really recommend it. Okay, no, I don't like this. There you go. <coughs> I think this is going to be it. I will say that um that I am um, what if I do this? I don't know. It's just trying, you know, like um, see how can I improve this. I mean, as I told you, it's like I'm. I don't dislike it, but I'm not totally sure. I'm just going to like do this, wait me a second. To create like tails, like a. Like, you know? And, uh, and this is more. I'll fix it in the next stream, but I want to sketch how it will look, you know? Something like this. And maybe this would be not here, but here. It's not looking bad. Something like this. Once you should draw on top of it, kind of like it. No. I will just catch a little bit of that set. Just 
se la vuelvo a dar se va kinda looks better like not that simple you know I mean I mean <laughs> I mean, I mean, it's not the big wow, whoosh, but um, it's not looking bad. Put it like this and blink. And I'm going to put here in this, there you go, some of this again. Sorry, this. This would be the small things here, you know, like the light below strikes a little bit the tile on top. You know, something like that. Just a little bit of this thing. Yeah. Why a castle? Well, this castle is um, this is for a webtoon where the owner is a vampire and he lives in this castle. Um, the idea is that he hired a housekeeper, a house maiden. And the housemaiden is not what he expect because he expected this uh, this shoujo type of girl, delicate and stuff. But the girl that appear uh, were um, were once a warrior, so she's super buffed. Well. Well, she's a strong. Uh, she's a strong and the idea is that the adventures of this ex warrior maiden sharing like their stuff with him. A uh, commission? No, it's a story. It's a project that I that I want to do. Um, and a story about um, a story I want to like a romance type of story that I want to create. I always have it in my mind, and I just you know I want to share it and create. So yeah, that's what happened here. So yeah, so the idea is that uh, he fell in love, he fell in love with her, but it's going to be di super difficult because she's not his type and he's not her type either. So the idea is that she was a warrior before and that's good because this vampire is really weak compared with other other, vamp other vampires because he's sick and he can leave his tower so bad this warrior is super strong the female warrior it's kind of like inspiring Valkyries mm, shrill maidens you know type of I think I'm going to leave it like this. I think I'm going to leave it like this for now. 
for today. Ooh. Jesus Christ! Two hours and almost three hours of stream. And just for that part, I feel like, um, well, let's hope in the next one it's not going to take us too much too much time. Um, thank you so much for watching and um, for being here with me, talking to me. Um, having a good time together here. See you tomorrow if you are. I'm not sure if tomorrow now I think about it. I think the Wednesday. I think I'm going to do another one the Wednesday. If you want, <laughs> I'll be here. And oh, Pink, he wants to say goodbyes. He wants to say goodbyes too. Mm. Um, and thank you again for watching this stream. See ya. <laughs> I'm going to close here. Bye bye. Thank you so much again. Woo!